Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Baron, and Unturned is back, and we're on the patch 3.0 test server of sorts. So let's check it out. Oh, that's a dude right there. Anyway, so obviously this game has been in development, and Nelson has been updating it relatively regularly until it came time for him to say, hey, it is time to make the 3.0 patch and really do it big. And from what I know, like, I have no idea where I'm going. There's no map or anything like that. Um, it looks gorgeous. The graphics are much improved. You can just look at the atmosphere right here. Um, the game looks really, really good. Now, we probably don't want to go off the edge of the map. But this is a test, so we can run, and you can see our energy bar in the far right, bottom right, going down. We gotta find a little bit of civilization, we gotta find some loot, some food, some weapons, all of that good stuff. Um, but how did I become aware of this? I saw Vuxy posted a video. Oh, and we've got some structures over here which we're gonna venture for, and I know there's like 26 or 27 people on the server right now. We just got a little bit of lag right there or something. This is a test server after all. It seems like lately, the past couple days, I've been on a bunch of test servers. Um, I just played a game called Undo Process, which was awesome in development. It's a beautiful shooting game. Pretty unique gameplay. Um, I'll have videos up on that shortly. And I was obviously on the War Thunder dev server because you know I love me some War Thunder tests. So this is the city that, if, is there really a, just a lot of people? I'm wondering what's going to happen. I feel like there was someone up down in the street over there where my cursor is located. But I'm not seeing any Zeds right now. I don't really think that may not be one of the things they're testing. It may just be a runaround. So let's, oh man, we got, we got some gunplay going on ladies and gentlemen. Here's a naked guy. I can't punch at all right now. And I'm sure everything's been looted. But let's take a look. We've got... Inventory. Nothing's coming up right yet. There's no hotkey bar. Oh. There is. So it's just like very different. But I've got two med kits and a water bottle now. Goodness. Check out this television. Let's try to turn it on. The power went out, guys. It's an apocalypse. What do you think happened? Check out this blue guy. Maybe I can trade it. But as far as what weapon's firing, I'm not really sure. Let's take a look at this kitchen. Rather well-developed kitchen. I assume this is a microwave. Nice refrigerator. Washer and dryer. It's a, it's a kitchen... Laundry room combination. Now this guy's green. Didn't we just see a blue guy? We gotta get the loot before he does. Got a tree coming in this house. Now we've got a dark guy running around. Green guy. Nice camouflage there, friend. Definitely have a lot of gunplay going on. So if that guy's going there, then he's gonna raid it before I can get there. Blue guy's there. Black guy's there. Oh yeah, there's definitely gunplay going on that house. We don't want to go there. A little bit of lag again. Let's take a look. Can we find anything before we get shot? Was that a gunshot? Pretty sure that that guy just shot over here. That guy had a really awesome purple beard. Was that a... Yeah. You've got a lot of people connecting on this. Like, people realizing it's available right now. I wonder if we're gonna run into Vuxy on this. Wouldn't that be funny? So this appears to be the police station. Was looted. Let's see, do we have a badge on the front? Oh yeah, we got police written on it. Supermarket's been raided. See, this is what it would really be like. What's up, red guy? Like, in a post-apocalyptic setting, man, you, you either have to be stockpiled or you're gonna have to be pretty fast and ruthless. Look at this guy coming in my house. This is my house. So there's nothing here. There's a really cool, like, shell-looking gas station over here. Oh, that guy disconnected. There's one guy with a gun. Wow, look how much that takes up. 
That's so cool. My hunger's at a 30%. Lots of lag experiencing, but you know what? We're just gonna be running around until we die for the most part, or until we kind of run out of things to explore. But I congratulate Nelson for getting, you know, a testable gameplay up and running um, right now. Makes you wonder if that guy's just got like unlimited ammunition or something. Let's go check out who's got this gun. Oh, that's definitely two guns. I would venture to say we have two guns. Now, can you loot anything out of these garbage dumps? No, but the fact that the garbage dumps are populated... What's this guy doing? Oh, that guy's holding a gun. For sure. Don't mind me. some of the backpack now we're gonna have to find some place to hide and see how you wear backpacks because we we got gunplay ladies and gentlemen all right so equip 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 all right now we put it on now if we tab oh yeah so i assume this is a hot bar maybe well a little more light but Check out my goatee and my haircut. It's gorgeous. Oh, that just spins me around. All right, so we do have a backpack. We do have, actually, we would like a med kit in case we take some errant shots. So two, yeah, you can see the the numbers right there. So we press two again, it should go away. Let's, let's see what's down further this road before, now that we have a backpack, you know, things seem to be going a little, little better than normal. I think in most cases, when I remembered first starting Unturned, like, finding a backpack was the biggest thing. Once you found a good backpack, you were more inclined to stay alive, you know, and look for stuff, even if it was a longer trek, especially when you found a good backpack. Now, this one's red. I'm not really, I, you know, I'm not familiar with that backpack. But that's a lot of ammunition being fired, and a lot of lead down range. So, let's see what's on the sign. Paul's hats. Oh, and we got some empty billboards, actually. Oh, we got... Maybe I can't... Yeah. Can't go past there. Are we... Oh, no, no, we just got some lag skip. Alright, so it seemed to have stabilized. Starbucks coffee. All right, so it just needs a little bit more rendering time. An intact shipping. What do we got over here? A little bit of a car just went over here. Oh, I was just about to say we have not gotten any lyrics. Lyrics? Lyrics a streamer, yeah? Big time streamer from what I understand. So we're going to check out down this road. Ah, man. I think it just started skipping when I went too far, but I'm not really... I'm, I'm, I'm tempted to try it again, and I should have earlier, but had to check out the signs. Yeah, that's what I thought. It was just some uh, lag on the server, because from what I understand, there's only one test server up right now. At least when I checked... Because now there's, you know, obviously a server list. Oh. Yeah. And it's kind of cool how you can see how things kind of render in slowly. And I'm sure that helps to optimize the game. We're going to run down in the middle of the road, which is what you would not want to do in a survival situation. Was that a guy? See, things render out as well. Now, can you pick flowers? Nope. And you can't punch. And there's some nice trees at the end of this road. So it makes me think that you just can't. There's nothing back here. Yeah, it's just that main city. So it's just a big brawl in the middle of the city. Let's trek back.
All right, we've got more gunplay happening as we get closer. So we're gonna creep through the trees here. Camouflage, even though we're a white dude with a black beard. Is that a guy on top of the building? Right there? No, just tip of the tree. So. Checking the inventory once again. Now, how fast do things populate on this test server? That's the question, because we'd like to find some kind of a weapon. It'd be kind of cool to see um, stuff populate in the garbage cans, even if it's like empty cans or bottles or something like that. What's up? Can't even see him. <laughs> Can't even see his eyes. Look at all these people. Just hanging out. Oh, that was like a very bright line. I was like, what is that? Oh, that was kind of close. These, they, I tell you what. These people before the apocalypse in Canada got some great TVs, man. Pharmacy's probably raided. We're just going to head to the gun gunfight. We can't find anything. We got a backpack, but like, what good's a backpack without anything to put in it? No police batons. Nobody locked in jail. I was like, what is, what's going on up there? But red building behind the grate. It looked like the guy had a maple strike earlier. So, anyway, so what are your overall impressions? That, that scared me. I thought there was a dude just there. Um, overall impressions of the graphics, because that's really what we get to see. You know, the the vegetation, the trees and stuff, I think look great. Definitely saw a guy pick up a maple strike. Check out this walled house. Yeah, we're just getting a little lag kicks again. But we haven't explored this area. This is a giant mansion. See, this is a totally new building type. This is their giant dining room where the fancy people sit down to have dinner. And we get mugged by... Whoa, did your beard just come up? or? Look at the TV! Tell you what, they lived very well. Go up the stair ramps. Check out the bedrooms, which are freaking giant. This guy... Hey, man, you got the short end of the stick. You got a washer and dryer in your bedroom. Alright, so what else do we got? Can we break legs? Oh, well, not from that height anyway. Giant house, mansion. Be fun to see like a really, really heavily populated city where you got like nice houses in the hills. You know, when I was, what is this? Oh, I thought it was something I could get. It's a radio. It'd be cool if you could find batteries and use it. But um, I remember like when the World Cup was happening reading about like the favelas um, outside of Rio and just listen to all the crazy stuff you know about that nice driveway interesting and it'd be cool to see like the different you know urban city types look at this, this guy just hanging out in a playground while there's some guy with an automatic gun pew pewing it up that'll probably be oh and here we go another nice big mansion this one white Opposite the other mansion. What do we got upstairs? Any kind of loot. When you have a ton of people in a small area, you're probably not going to find much loot. We were pretty lucky to find that bottle of water and the health, but we just want a melee weapon. But I think overall, what we're supposed to be really <laughs> testing and kind of getting to play with because they're likely to update this all the time and if you want to learn how to get on it check the video description below um, and you will find the instructions on how to do it fire hydrant look at me couches look how good I am at identifying things kick over fire hydrant and see a geyser grossa alright where are the guys with guns at I want to know where the guns at these guys got guns. Is it lagging right now? Dude, everything's in here. 
it's probably lagged out right now. And these guys are just killing everybody. Hmm. <laughs> but let's take a look at this stuff. We'll probably, it'll probably change and then we'll die. But that is an M4 with a suppressor or a maple strike. You know, four grip. This guy's got the same. He's using the iron sights. Nice gun you got there, friend. These guys are like robbing the store right here. Oh, that guy disconnected. But looks pretty good. Looking really, really good. Hello. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me, friend. Just getting some fun views. Picking up some shades, man. I want to pick up all this stuff, but pretty sure the servers just kind of crash. So we've explored the city. We've seen kind of the weapons that would be available for you to kind of test out and have fun with. There's a lot more detail in the majority of the buildings. And I think that may have just done it. So if we head back, nope. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that was an early preview on Unturned Patch 3.0.0.1. Nelson, thanks for that. That's awesome. Um, really enjoyed that. Looking forward to seeing what happens next. Stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Baron. Thanks for watching.